Hey guys, Filthy Robot here, continuing our Imperial Ideals campaign with the Roomba, where we're getting Commonwealth, and it's pretty painful. Yeah. It's not easy, I'll tell you that much. No, and um, uh, I didn't have my discipline idea in, so we've cycled that back in now. Yep, yeah. so I also turned on my discipline idea. I had my morale one on, but not the discipline one. Same, same. I mean, for crying out loud, the French are probably easier to fight right now than the Commonwealth. Oh, absolutely. Six point Nine three morale. It's just it's so much. Are you ready to unpause? I did. Yeah. I just unpause. Yeah, it's fine. I'm pathing over to help deal with this. Uh, if we want to, oh fuck. I don't want to. He fight. ran away. So that that army, he broke his siege, and that army is actually pretty weak in the front line. It's only got eighteen in the front row, and they're pretty damaged. Okay. I don't know if that's something you want to try to engage again. Are you close before. enough to help to it? Where's your other stack? Your th oh, it's a French stack. stack. Oh, I thought that French stack was your stack because the blue the colors of blue are so close. You're actually in trouble then. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we need to get our armies together, take similar fights. Are we, we're not allies in the same war. Can we even dogpile on each other or no? As long as we're um, both hostile to all forces, we should be able to fight at the same time. Okay. As, uh, anyone that we're both red to. Okay. Who am I going to fight? I, I mean, I've got to stop the French because if they go after the Utrecht province and prevent me from getting my ticking war score, I'm going to have a hard time with that. The Castilians should take care of distracting in the south. Uh, the Ottomans. The Ottomans have to pull through. If the, if the Ottomans really start to wreck the southern part of the Commonwealth, then the Commonwealth is going to swing most of their attention to the east. They're in there. I mean, they have four provinces occupied, including a, one fort, and they're moving north. So that should be good. Yeah, we need to. Yeah, it would be very good to peace. <laughs> be very good to peace out Commonwealth. So. Well, naturally. Are you ready to pause? Yes, go ahead. Well, I need a recovery tick, and then I'm going to probably go try to attack this French army just to prevent them from sieging. I need more than one recovery tick. Just a quick pause because... Waiting to see if this will happen. Neutral attitude. Hmm... What are you trying to do? I'm trying to get a royal marriage with uh, Portugal. He has no heir right now. A child in the reeds. I just got a potential heir. Weak claim 531. I'd say no. I'd say no to that. Man, my morale. I still need time to recover my morale. Can't. I can't even go fight this French stack without really seriously jeopardizing the strength of my troops. Where are my cannons? Here. All right. Okay, so 3.26 morale against the French. The French have what ideas? They've got full offensive, administrative, exploration, and expansion. So they do have Elan, which is plus 20% morale. They don't have morale from defensive ideas yet. I don't have any ideas that help my morale, like, at all, I think. And I have a... I thought I had a guy that, like, lowered my morale. Yeah, Craven. My my ruler's Craven. Yeah, Fantastic. I'm, re I'm regretting I'm regretting uh, quantity ideas. I thought it would be very nice for what we we're doing, but I just my troops aren't really strong enough to deal with these ridiculous morale bonuses coming out of Commonwealth. I think I'm gonna go pure infantry for this fight. Combat width is thirty. If my cannons are under under morale. Does it matter for their damage, or it doesn't matter if they're damaged, right? All it is going to impact is the total morale of my army. If they're under morale, yeah, yep. Yeah. They'll keep fighting as long as they have at least uh, some number greater than zero. Okay. All right. Well, I got to try to fight this French stack. So Good let's luck. hope that the rolls go well, even though I only have like half morale. And the French have five point six morale versus my four point nine. That's a lot more Craven. manageable than six point nine. Craven is such a bad trait. I am not liking this ruler's trait. Come on, Wenzel. Wenzel rolls a nine versus a three. We'll take it. Also, what gives? My combat width is 30. Did I? Damn it. I didn't even check. He's only got 20 in the front row. I should have sent my calf. Sorry. Sorry. Right. Okay, I just won my battle. I lost 7,000 men to kill 
near 10,000. He's going to shatter far away. Okay, I'm good to unpause for a day or two if you are. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go fight this Ottoman stack in a moment, but I'm waiting on one more recovery tick. Something, something Venice just happened. Yeah, I don't read that shit either. You can call in allies. I can call you in to defend against the French. That would actually give us the ability to for sure be uh, participant in each other's battles and also give you vision of the French. I'm fine with that if you'd like to do that. As long as they don't call any other allies in, that'd be fine. Uh, since it's a defensive war, we don't have to worry about truce breaks because you're not, I'm not the aggressor. This shouldn't hurt you. Uh, okay. So accept it. Okay, okay, I'm going I, I, to... Fucking up my train of thought here with repeated pauses. Can we get, like, a little bit of time? Are you, uh... Mm -hmm. If ahead, you want to yeah. kill this 24 stack, I've got all of my troops next to it. God damn okay, it. hold on. What the hell? Okay, the great, great power Muscovite has intervened and joined our enemies in the French conquest of Utrecht. So because I called you in... Yeah. You just you got Muscovy against this now. Fantastic. That's, yeah. that's wonderful news. I'm not very thrilled about that, I must say. I am not either. All right, well, we gotta get. Well, we've just changed the whole scope of this fight, which is now. Which is supposed to be versus Commonwealth. We now need to peace out France. And I honestly think that's where we should be focusing our efforts. Well, his enthusiasm's at 47. Relative strength of the alliance is, is against him, which is a great sign. Winning that fight helps. He's never gonna get to Utrecht. He's gotta go through multiple forts, one of which is coastal. Yeah, why don't we just uh, go siege, like, siege a couple of his forts over there? His forts are level 2 and one's level 4. I can get, if I siege Ghent and then Picardy, I can get to his capital. Yeah. Let's just, we, we gotta knock him out of the war so that this war will end. I mean, if you knock him out, he's the war leader. So that ends that war, so we can go focus everything on Commonwealth. Which is what we need to do, because Commonwealth is scary as, is scary as shit right now. Alright, I will put together a siege force. Okay. And I will go after Ghent. And I want your troops right now to start heading to Trier. I know it's woods right now. I'm not necessarily going to attack into it, but I want to be near this Commonwealth stack. It's 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 a 14. He's at 14 front row. Like we should be able to just cream that. I like it when you talk dirty. Yes. You, you, cream you, on you it wanna, and then cream it. You want to cream cream that? That's that sounds delectable. You spend a lot of time alone in the computer room, don't you? Oh, uh, you do too. <laughs> Well, is there anything I can do to make these stupid Portuguese like me better? I just need a little bit more. Can I get a diplomatic reputation advisor? Yes. Okay. Uh, I'm ready to unpause if you are. Yeah, go ahead. All right, I'm on Gens. I'm going to potentially risk my navy to try to make the sea chap a little bit faster since I can hide in, in my own port, Holland. They're about to take... Uh, one of my forts, Hamburg, Brandenburg is in the north, but I can't really focus on that. I like that the 24 stack of Commonwealth troops is like surrounded by all of your men. And yes, if the Ottomans want to frontline that fight, that'd be great. Yeah, so I was just looking to help have happen. Okay, hold on. Oh. Is Saxony, Saxony is our ally? He's my vassal, and yes, he's going to be engaged. Okay, but that gives us defender. Locked. Yeah, um, he's not locked though. Uh, I don't want my vassal, he's gonna my vassal he's gonna, sacrificial. No, he's gonna stack wet the shit out of that if we don't get there first. Are you kidding me? Alright, well he might not take the move now. If he doesn't take the move, that's fine, but Oh, there he goes. Okay. Alright, cool. Yeah. So you get to be the defender. Hopefully. See what Wait, I mean? Like two campaign. Yeah, okay, we got there in time. It was really close though. Commonwealth has just hired the Wallachian army. I'm, and I need like this is why I want your troops here. Look at the morale difference here. This is absurd. Like I might not I might not I might lose the fight before I can reinforce it. I'm two provinces out. Okay. Feeling a little Pause bit better. I need to. No, I'm working on Ghent. I'm concerned that if I leave that siege stack on Ghent, that I'm going to get uh, attacked by the French. All right. We are somehow, like, with 80k, we're just breaking even with the Commonwealth. Do you need me to actually reinforce this? Because I'd rather not get... I need a recovery tick if I don't need to be in there. My, my troops need I don't actually know the answer. I don't need it probably this much. I, I mean, I'm sitting... I mean, you can see the numbers, right? Yeah. The, if I reinforce, I'm not actually going to do anything. I'm just going to be there and not get my reinforcement tick. I'm currently at double his morale. So I should be okay. Alright, um, I'm going to try to get back to my own land so that I can get my recovery. I did breach the walls on my first roll in Ghent, nice. so 
It was pretty cheap, by the way, to uh, attack into a breached wall. So, like, it was... Pr I've used it now once or twice, but rushing it was kind of cool. Okay, okay, check to see if he's shattering down to French Compte. I think he might be. I think he's stuck behind your ports and stuff. And he's got occupation of French Compte, which is my vassal's capital. Or so you Burgundy. think... So I'll just go straight to Burgundy. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look, actually, no, no, no. Fight look, right there's, there. a battle, there's a battle in Metz. You're going to stack weapon like, in three days. Good. Awesome. That's that would be so super good. good. That, these, his troops are just so scary, man. They just do so much. Didn't insta stack okay. wipe because he got a reinforced tick annoyingly. Uh, I just lost an advisor. Just give me a second. Uh, we're going with all level one advisors. Hell yeah. Yeah, I'm not much better right now because of cash. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um... <laughs> you ready to unpause? I'm yes, sorry. I yes, keep I pausing am. a lot. I, I'm, it's just that I'm... This war is not good. That initial stack wipe of half my army was horrible. I could try Jeez. to start... Considering I just stack wiped this guy, he is holding, like, this is ridiculous. He's a ridiculous man. These are ridiculous stats in this. Yeah, you, you want to play as a powerful nation, play as a goddamn commonwealth. This 13 stack is, like, holding even with my 78k here. We've lost the Siege of Wismar in, like, 80 days. Damn, they are uh, taking my forts to the north pretty darn quickly. They've got a lot of cannons. Okay, uh, well, the fort in Ghent is about to fall. Um, definitely chase into French comp. I think that's where he's retreating. Yeah. You don't need to send your whole army. Like, make sure you're not suffering attrition on the monthly tick in Lothringen. Only send enough men to engage the force that he still has. Well, I just Plus, engaged the force with 80k, and, and it, instead of wiping it out, he had one recovery tick, and it took us, like, 12 rounds or something. Yeah, but, but like, if you lock your entire army into the combat, then a monthly tick happens, you're not getting the recovery tick. Yeah, yeah. Right. So well, you let me well let me pull some guys necessary. out. Yeah, yeah. Maybe maybe a few extra just in case there's reinforcements nearby, but don't just like lump it all together. Where's the French fleet? Don't unpause Six quite yet. Okay. Stupid ass Commonwealth, man! I swear. I have okay, maybe thirty nine reasons for white peace with the French. Go ahead and unpause. Oh, he's not retreating there. Oh, fuck, I just tried to spam space. Where is he going? He's going to the Austrian fort instead. Okay, that's oh, fine. I can still... Yep, yeah, I can still catch uh, him. You arrive on the 4th of June. He arrives on the 31st. Uh, is there any way, if you put, like, a higher maneuver general in charge, or if you force march, can you get I there on the 31st? I'm in hostile territory. I might be able to force march. How do I... If I click it, uh, do I have force march? You, you should, use yeah. stationary units to force march. You haven't let any days pass. You just, you just, we just paused. So tell him to stop moving. Okay. Press M to turn on Force March. Right click to see if you'll arrive on the before the monthly tick. Right click this. Okay, so okay, I see. You'll arrive when? On the second. So don't Force March. There's no point. That's unfortunate. By one day, well, two technically. You you could have uh, okay. gotten there ahead. Yeah, we oh, get well. strong. Okay. So he'll get a reinforcement tick. A little bit of morale. And yep. by a little bit, I mean like eight, because that's what he's going to reinforce, because he's a cheating bastard. Yeah. Yeah, okay. and I'll probably lose the fight. <laughs> it's a woods fort. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to, uh, to unpause again if yeah, you are. Yeah, go ahead. I need to, hold on, roll one, one, I just need to insult the rival. Oh, I can, forgot about that, that's a good idea, hold on, let me just, can, you can't insult rivals at war who have peace deals or something, I think it's if you're, you're truce. rivals. Truce. Truce, okay. Truce, you can't insult them. So let me take a look, so I don't have a peace with Hungary, I don't assume. Let's insult them, I could use the, uh. Okay, go ahead. Okay, so I'm gonna peace out the Commonwealth. <laughs> okay, just kidding. 35% chance I'm gonna take Ghent. And uh, I don't know that we really need to, to contribute all of our resources to, to trying to fight the French. God, between this is freaking ridiculous. War, this fucking morale is ridiculous. What are you rolling? A four minus two. So you have a five, you have a three versus an eight. A big part of it. Yep, but I'm. I gotta. I gotta try to stack with this army. It ran to woods, so I don't get like great options there. Is you got finally it. dead. Nice. It finally you dead. It. That's amazing. It's finally. It's finally dead. Okay. Okay. I guess I'm going to try to siege Ghent with a secondary siege leader. Since I'm standing around doing nothing with this army right now. Okay. All right. 
Spy network, people state. I'm really annoyed by all the troops that are in my north. For some reason, the uh, the Denmark troops are too stupid to actually try to take back the war goal. He's actually just marching around it for some reason. Don't unpause quite yet. I need to move troops around. Yeah, this is level 12 or fort, so we need 12 troops. It's 11. Commonwealth feels very strong in my war. Uh, Denmark is feeling pretty good too about the relative strength of the alliance. You can unpause whenever you want. The French are currently ongoing battles plus 18, length of war. They're yeah, fighting they... uh, Aragon in the south. Okay, I, I wonder how the Castilians are doing. Aragon's on tech 16, Castile's on tech 15. Well, they should provide some sacrificial bodies, at least. I'm glad you you stack like that Commonwealth stack. That kind of makes up for my lost army, but... Um... Okay, I've got Ghent. That gives me 7 individual war score with the French. Negative 35 reasons for a white piece. I'm going to have to move on to his capital, I think, to actually get this guy out. But Yeah, but Pickering... we need him out because we need to focus on the Commonwealth. Because you just saw, it just took us, I don't, it took me like eight times his manpower to like do the same damage he's doing with that army. This is why like I'm so worried, like when you allied them, I'm like, this is the wrong way to do it. Because we're never going to, I don't think he's going to get weaker relative to us. I mean, he it will a little bit, but you know what well, I mean? Like, when you ally a strong nation like the Commonwealth like that, you just, you just declare wars that are bad to make them do all the work. And mm -hmm. that's how you weaken them. No, I suppose that's an interesting idea, but I felt like we had the Ottomans. If we, if I had not screwed up that uh, uh, accidentally clicking uh, co-belligerent, we would have had France and the Ottomans in our war versus uh, the Commonwealth, which was the plan. Hold on, I actually... Uh, no, damn. I don't have a straight shot. I can go... As long as Namor is up. If I take down Namor, which is inland, it's, it's a level 2 fort, but it's not coastal. It'll probably be... Just as fast to siege that, and I can stay closer to you. So I'm gonna do that instead, I think. Okay. Uh, let's send these cannons forward, these cannons over, pull this cannon off, join that over there. Alright. Unpausing. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna focus on Namur. I don't want to... Picardy just feels way too far away from where you might be. And I just lost Gerhard on something or other. My f Nope, not my 4-5. Good. And... Friedrich, my, uh, my actual leader, is... I think all of the French troops are in the south right now. Okay, I'm pausing again. Sorry for the, all the pauses, but... Alright, there's a 33 stack of Commonwealth troops moving towards me uh, that I would like to pay attention to. Just sieging Warsburg now. And if fucking... Those troops we were hoping to get rid of. France is attacking into me in woods right now, if you want to consider reinforcing. In... Lostromsberg. Let me just get some guys over here. My army's kind of split up weirdly. 22 and 2. I'm wider than him, though, if he does that. That should be fine. My best leader's there. Okay. Uh, I actually want to take this fight, then. Go ahead and unpause. You paused. Go ahead. Okay. I am nearby. He just reinforced. He's at 58k. Is he locked? He's locked now. Okay. So we're going to grab that. I'm going to reinforce from here with my cannons. This is going to take me a while to get down there. I've got to go. I don't have access through Lundberg, or sorry, the edge. So, uh, I'm not actually able to get to you very quickly. It's fine. I have a lot of defense. I've, I've got woods here, which makes me feel good. His leader is pretty pretty good, but he's got a 5-3. Yep. Yeah, we got to end this war with the French. You're right. If we, if we have to fight France and Muscovy, this is going to yeah, be Yeah, we're going to get screwed. So, 
Okay. Now I'm worried that 33 sec is going to start running over here too. So just just start moving this way. I understand it'll be a while, but just in case, they, I mean, because you can see those guys to your east, the 26, the 27, and the 33. The AI just seems to be like anytime a war happens anywhere within about 10 provinces, like every single unit starts moving there. And on these long fights, it can screw you. Oh, come on. Really? This greedy little French bastard. <laughs> He has like 58 case troops locked in to fight me, and he diverts his 29 stack to go wipe out a 1 stack. Whatever. He's gonna pay for it, but it's just ridiculous. Well, his other troops can't really commit. Uh, I am nearby. I'm heading to Metz. Do you need reinforcements on this? He's reinforcing you fuller. Oh, he just retreated. Okay. Pause, reevaluate, recalculating. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Um... I'm concerned about all the sieges that are happening in the east right now. Is Are the Ottomans at least doing a good job against the Commonwealth? Uh, yes. yes. They've they occupied are. and they've started to transfer some forts to you. You'll notice in the northeast, Smolensk. Okay, I hadn't noticed the transfer. That's good. He's actually sieging down Polotsk as well. I can't see it, but I know that he's doing it because I can just... Uh, he's him. about to fight. Muscovy has just showed up to, to rescue Polotsk. Are so you sure not... that the Ottomans are hostile to... I am no. not sure. They're not hostile. Ottomans okay. are allied to the Muscovy. Yeah, they're oh, not going to fight okay. each other. Cool. Okay, um, so what's your actual war scores at right now? Uh, with... What like do the you common, With, with oh, Austria? 13% against uh, Austria. I mean, Austria is at low. Or actually, Austria is at media right now. But I have 13% on the war score of that particular, of that particular war. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. All right. You can unpause for a moment here. We could get some stack wipes of these French stacks that he's trying to train up. That would be really nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm supposed to get be getting four right here. Yeah, I just got four, right? three out. No, one got out. Okay, I grab here and grab there. That is a lot of derps up yeah, there. I see 83,000 83, troops in the province of Oldenburg right now. Yeah. So I'm getting many a fourth men. siege. My, I'm glad I moved my cap because otherwise it'd be occupying my cap here and it'd be really bad. Those are the Commonwealth men. We don't want to fight those. I know we don't want to fight them, but I'm as I said, I'm really glad I moved my my capital right before this war, because otherwise I'd be getting huge amounts of war exhaustion from that. Okay. Well, whenever you're ready to unpause, I'm good to go. Almost. Bremian yes. separatists are about to fire in the province of Bremen. That would be nice. They would totally be killed by the enemy right now. <laughs> this would all be so much easier if I didn't have goddamn espionage ideas. Yeah. Maybe, yeah, maybe not. I'm not sure. There now. Fuck. Okay, there might be a fight here. Mm, maybe not. We'll see. Okay. Um. You will definitely reinforce that. But that is a pretty juicy target. A 1 1 Denmarkian army against my 4 5. Yeah, I've got to take that fight. Okay, um, we have to put a cut in here, but okay. this is uh, this is the most exciting war we've had in a little while. That last episode or whatever it was where we had pure peace, that was boring. <laughs> Didn't like, did not like that. No. All right. Well, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you soon. See you in a bit.